Yours isn't moving anymore, is it? Mine was too, but I think it was too. It's because I was messing with it. Check one, two, we're live at Pershing Field Ballpark where your Minnetonka skippers are taking on the Minneapolis Southwest. And the Skippers are playing the uh, Minneapolis Southwest Lakers, believe it or not. So, yeah, we are right in the middle of uh, a couple lakes. If you were to do an aerial, we got Harriet. And, well, we're right in the city of lakes, I guess. That's what it is. So I think I'm going to get Chad Colbert to join me here in the studio later. That would be awfully nice. 
leading off Minnetonka. Get my O line up out in front of me. Lauren Volling is going to lead us off. Volling, the junior. The righty steps in, and we are off. First pitch taking strike. Nice hit out to left field. That's going to be a base hit. Walling gets us started. Good way to start for the skippers. Addie Singer is going to step in. Number four. Singer also a junior. Throws down a bunt. Great hustle by the catch. Makes the throw. Advances the runner, though, so the sack bunt does what it's supposed to do. Singer dropped it really close to home plate, so really nice drop attempt, uh, but good job by the Lakers. Go, 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 Hedrick steps in. First pitch ball. Wow. It's a one-on-one -on -one count. No scoreboard here, so I'm going to have to stay on top of things here. Check. Turn off the wind. Ball. Follows it right back, click at click, who's in the on deck, on deck circle. Great batting cleanup today. 22 is your count. Run around first. We're scoreless here, top of one. Ball outside. That'll fill up the count. Foul. So what I failed to tell you is, no, nope, never mind. That's foul. Thirty-two. So volleying on second, scoring position. Ball low rolls through. Hedrick takes her base. So runners on first and second. Click steps in with one out. Click takes one way out to the left. Is it going to drop? Yes, it will. It'll get by the outfield there. So she's going to have to chase it down. That's going to score two. And Click's going to hold at one at two as well. And so Click with lead off. First pitch double, and that's going to score two. So fantastic start for the skippers here as they take a commanding two to zero lead early in the first inning. And Wishmeyer is going to step in now for Minnetonka. She's catching. Nice change of misses. Ball high. Red 47, but that looked a lot faster than that. 
So I'm not sure about the situation there. Wishmeyer takes it way right, and it's going to go foul. 45 on the pitch speed. Hmm. If that's really the case, I'd be surprised. Wish my like I'm ready to back at the pitcher. She reacts. Wow. Excuse me for yelling in the microphone, but that went straight back right at the gut of the pitcher. Holy cow. She was able to knock it down with her glove. Gets the out at first. Click advances to third. And the commotion. So she rounds from first to third. Or second to third, rather. She got a double. Lizzie Harrison batting now for the Skippers. Lizzie's going to be pitching today. Lizzie takes one way out to center left. And she's going to get to two. Stand up double. So these pitches are, I guess, I uh, don't want to take anything away from the Skippers, but maybe they are coming in at those high 40s and they're just all over them. Harris certainly was all over that one. Harrison. Going to come out since she's pitching, so we have a courtesy runner coming in. I didn't see who it was. Kylie Kulberg steps in. Inside pitch. Kulberg jacked one yesterday. To seal the deal against Eden Prairie. Gets a hold of that one, but it's just going to go down the third baseline. Foul. One ball, one strike. Nice pitch there. Change up drops in. Kahlberg watches it drop in. So it's one ball, two strikes. Harrison on second base. Or no, I'm sorry. Courtesy runner for Harrison. Kylie likes that one. Gets just enough of it. And runs it. And they give. And she's safe. So you saw it at home on the Zoom. This would be my expert camera skills. So Bria Callan, no, Callan, steps in. The junior. She's either center field or right field. I couldn't tell if it was a seven or nine in the carbon copy of the roster. So first pitch comes in ball. Ball low. Two balls, no strikes. Two down here. First inning, top of the first. Skippers have come out firing. They got three run lead. With a runner on third. And Bria Callen looking to move it around, and that comes right at my face. 21. I'll have to pull our camera to the left here in a second. I'm going to fall up out of play. Very short backstops here at Minneapolis Southwest, home of the Lakers. So 22 now, the count. Ball low, well, I mean high, rather. <laughs> Kalen holds. That's a full count where I come from. Go, 
ball, and that's going to put her on. So good eyes here on the skippers. That's the second walk of the Indian. Olivia Donaldson, who's the DP, comes in. Donaldson likes that one, goes right back at the pitcher. She's going to make the easy toss to first for the third out of the inning, but the damage has been done against the Minneapolis Southwest Lakers as the skippers come out firing away, putting three up on the board. Let me see what I got. I got one, two, three, four. Four hits. No errors. They did leave one out up there on base. Left several out there. So with that, let's see what we got going on out here. Your skippers. Outfield. So it looks like click at first. Harrison's pitching. Wishmeyer is going to catch. So click is on first. Second is Singh volleying over on third. Collins is at your shortstop. And then this is where I'm a little uncertain. I got Callen in left, which makes sense to me because Kahlberg over in right. Then in center field, we got Hedrick, which is usually where I see uh, Izzy Gutenfelder. But this is what I'm getting off of the, yeah, look at that. That is exactly what's happening here as we enter the bottom of the second, or first. First pitch comes in and batter throws down a bunt. This is also a Harrison they have on their team. So Harrison versus Harrison here. Big swing there now from 19. Just said one ball, two strikes. Ball low. First time we've seen Harrison pitch for the Skippers this year. Big swing and a miss. 49 on the pitch speed. So first pitcher or first batter faced by Harrison. Happens to be named Harrison. And Harrison strikes out Harrison. There's a nice pitch. Oh, I'm not sure how that missed. That one's 57. You know, check one. Nice pick. Yeah, thank you. Twenty-one is your score. Harrison looking at that outside edge, outside the corner. Goes here again and gets Harris or uh, Zilla to swing. The ringer count to twenty-two. Pitch there, nails it at 57. Gets her looking. That was a brilliant pitch. Not a lot of movement on it, just some speed. 57 on the speed. Woo! 
right back at Harrison. Knocks on the great job for the third out. Holy buckets. That went right at Harrison. The Har at Harrison. I don't think it hit her. All right. So three at three down there. So the pitcher, Walker, is the pitcher for Minneapolis Southwest Lakers. I don't have a roster, so can't give you any stats on there, players. We're back at the top of the order. Got through the order last inning. Bats were alive for the skippers. Racking up four hits. Three runs on the four hits. Walling started us off with a single last at bat. Let's see if she can keep her trend alive. Ready to play ball. Tell why the shadow sun's off to our right side. High, still in the sky. Lobs one in at forty five. Forty-six. So uh, it's not the gun. It is the. Uh... Oops, sorry. It is the truth. That one comes in at forty-eight. Bowling takes it to center right. Rounds, but she's going to hold. So she'll stay hot. Eddie Singer. She got thrown out first, hit it right back to the pitcher ball high. Hedrick on deck. Holds 48 in speed. Nice pitch there. Hole 46 on the speed. Just got ahead of it. Just knocked it well over to the track. Right behind us is the track for the Lakers and their. Looks like to be football and soccer fields. Big set of bleachers to our back. Ball high, 46. So three balls. One strike. And that one's going to hit. So now full count against Singer. See what she's going to do this time. Singer 0 for 1 on the day. And that's going to be a ball. She does not offer. And she will walk. Which then takes falling over to second. So two on for Hedrick. Hedrick, who walked her last at appearance.
Who takes one fouls it left? Got a lot of the bat though. One ball, one strike on Hedrick. A lot one up here to Kennedy. Nope, she doesn't fight for that. That's high. 46. Two balls, one strike. Inside, and she goes after it. Two balls, two strikes, 48 on that pitch speed. Lobs one in, right up over my head. 43, and boy, it knocks down a bunch of pine cones. That ball brings us to a full count. Strike three, Hedrick doesn't agree. She was taking her base, but uh, Walker's gonna earn her first K on the day. Click, who had a crushing double last at bat, enters into the bay, into the box. She's got two out there. Ball low, 44 on the speed. Look, click like that one. Could it drop? It could. Oh, and it drops out of her glove. So I think we're going to have an error. So clicks. Oh, well, the. So she's out. So what happened there? I'm not sure if you noticed, but uh, I don't think Singer had advanced. She was holding on the fly ball, and so when she missed, dropped it, came out of her glove. Then Singer, of course, was in a tough spot. That's kind of uh, why they have the infield fly rule when it's actually infield or in the infield. Wow! Big crush, crushing hit there by Wishmeyer, but it's brought down. In the glove of the right fielder. Yeah, so she got stuck standing by second because it was right to the outfielder, but then the outfielder dropped it. But no double play was made. So that'll get him out of the inning, though. So I think click, I wasn't watching. It might give that, uh, she might get on with an error on that one. I'll verify that later with the official scorebook, but that's what I'm going to go down with. She's not going to like me much for that, I'm sure. Um, Wishmeyer came up. Yeesh. Oh, no. The fall. Oh, no. I can move if I'm in the way of people. All right, here we go. We're going to start... Firing up again here. Harrison back in the circle. Bye outside. We're at the four, five, six batters. That one's a strike. Ballo. Harris is your batter. She first baseman. Two balls, one strike. Ball 
Ball low and inside. So 31. And ball four. Harris gets her first, gives up her first walk of the day. Harrison, if I said that wrong. Ball inside. And Tomaska, number five, your center fielder for Minneapolis Southwest Lakers. Minnetonka have a three to zero lead right now. That was a strike. Foul into the backstop. One ball, two strikes. Wind is coming from my right side. I'm exactly behind home plate, and the breeze is good. Now it's coming right in my face, and that's a foul. One ball, two strikes on Tomaska, center fielder out of Minneapolis Southwest. Ball outside. Twenty-two is your count. Let's see where Harrison's throwing here. Nice glove by Click. Great, just good hustle. Great hustle by Volling over on third. Runner advances though, so there's got a runner in scoring position. Steerick. Ball inside. Actually bounced right in front of Number 27, ball. Number 27, Stock. The last name. Two balls, one strike on Stock. Runner on second. One out here. In the bottom of two. Minnetonka lead, 3-0. Ball high. Bounced up out of Wishmeyer's glove. She gets control. So stock ahead, 3-1 three, one, three, one on the count. Gets her looking. She jumps and tries to sell it, but can't do so. Foot count. Ball inside, and that's going to walk, second walk on the day. So runners on first and second for the Lakers. Lakers versus the Skippers here. DeMarco, your shortstop for Minneapolis Southwest, steps into the box. First pitch strike. Ball, 50. It's a nice piece of that. That's going to get through the gap. 
Good score one. We'll see what happens. She's coming. Oh, Wish takes a bad bounce in front of Wishmeyer. Bad bounce in front of Wishmeyer. That's unfortunate. Nice back up there by Lizzie Harrison, though, to pick it up off the backstop, try to throw her down at third as she advanced off the throw. But nice toss from center field. And uh, it did take a just an uh, awkward bounce, unfortunately. So nice, solid hit by DeMarco. She gets on on a double, or probably a single. Chance is on fielder's choice, and then on the throw. And that's going to get out to the outfield and bring in another one, potentially. In. Here we go. Nobody's covering home. Wow. So the left hit the left field. The throw comes in. It's off. Wishmeyer goes after it to at the backstop, as does Harrison. So then there's nobody at home plate to cover the throw. So they're gonna have a little chat about that, probably regroup. That was unfortunate, but then that scores two. Actually, we got a tie ball game here, folks. Smith is your batter. She's a right fielder. Foul. Only one out, too, by the way. One and one. Can be a direct throw over to Vaughn. Nice play, double play there. Singer, quick to respond, and an Adam ball, right? Adam. So she takes that and she fires it back down over to Volume for the second out of the inning, but the damage is done. So that's a double play. And now Minnetonka is going to take the bat. We got ourselves a ball game. Do up is Harrison, Kulberg, and Callen. That is your six, seven, eight batters. So Lizzie Harrison steps in, the junior from Minnetonka. Follows it down the third baseline. Forty-five on the pitch. Down the third baseline. Foul. One ball, two strikes.
Ball high. Twenty-two is your count on the pitcher for Minnetonka. Just reaches for that one down to shortstop. Nice scoop takes it to first for the six-three combo. First out of the inning. Culberg steps in. Culberg takes first pitch strike. Culberg likes that one, trails it down through the gap between. Short and third, she's going to get a base hit. She stays hot. Her second hit on the day. Callan steps in. She watched her last appearance. Callan likes it, goes after it, follows it into the backstop. Ball low. Bree Callen shows bunt, pulls back. Catcher checks runner at first. Two balls, one strikes, your count. Ball comes in, flies high for ball. 31's your count. Ball, oh, she's going to take a walk as she did last time. So she'll go 0 for 2 on the day. 0 for 0, actually. Donaldson steps in. Oh, wait, let me make sure of that. First pitch strike. Runners on first and second. Tie ball game here. Ball low. We're in the bottom top of the third inning. Just joining us. The top came out. Bats were a live pop fly. And that's not going to have a drop. So it's foul. Tonka comes out with some hot bats. Just starts crushing it. Walling starts this off with a single. Goes on Hedrick. Click gets hit. Hale Harrison gets clear hit. Kohlberg. With three up in the first inning. Here's a strike. And shits another strikeout today for Walker. Donaldson. So two down. So then, the last half inning, Natanka had some unusual. Defense, which resulted in a couple of runs here and there. Strike one on our top of lineup, volume. So Taka's got their work cut out for him. Ball high. One ball, one strike. Delivery. Strike two. So now, one ball, two strikes is your count. 
Balling, who's two for two, looking to keep the streak alive. There she gets one, and that's going to do it. Up the gap. Nice job, and rounding. Coming in home. Nice scores one. And Balling's going to make it over to second on the fielder's choice. A nice shot. Hard ground ball hit up. And that's going to bring home Kulberg. And Callen is over on third. Addie Singer's going to step in. She's walked and went her last appearance. Chops down the bunt. And the sack bunt scores one, advances the runner from second to third. So well played bunt. Yeah, she actually is safe. So now Minnetonka regain the lead. 4-3. Bunt showing. Runner goes. No play made as the differential will advance Singer. Indifference, rather. It's been a long season. Ooh, big crack back at Click. Good thing she was on her toes. Check one. So Hedrick, strike on. No balls, one strike. That's going to go up high. Volleying thought about coming after the uh, wild pitch goes high up over the catch. Ball low, scrolls, rolls through, hits the umpire, so it stops. You got 21, but it might be off. I don't think I'm right. That's a strike. That's a really nice pitch. Hedrick. I'm surprised she didn't take that. These pitches are only coming in. They're high 40s. Let's get some numbers from my angle here. 43. Now she'll take that one. That loads this up for click. Click. So click who, depending on how you look at it, I'm not sure if they scored an error at her last at bat or a hit, but she's gotten on base both times. Looking to keep the streak alive here. She's got ducks on a pond. Ball high. Quick take strike. One ball, one strike. Click takes that one. That's going. That's going. That's caught at the fence. Oh, it felt good. <laughs> I, I couldn't see it through the dumb underneath the pine tree, but Click got a big piece of it. Boy, that would have been a nice grand slam, but it did not go. So Click will go out with an F8. Leaves three on. Woo. But, uh, Tanaka got two more there. I got five and three confirmed with the official book. Five, three. Lots of confusion on what the score is. I'm glad I wasn't the only one, even though I'm running keeping a book here. It's the only reason why I had it. But with that, we got 
the Lakers up here as we're entering the bottom of the third inning. So I think we're at the top of the lineup, if I'm not mistaken. Number 19, Harrison, comes in. Harrison Bunts shows Bunt the offer. Comes out to be a strike. I'm sorry, this is Harris. Harrison. One ball, one strike. Forty nine on the pitch. Although I'm kind of off to the side, so I'm not sure my gun is correct, but 21 is your count. Tries the job, bunt, and that's... Wait, I don't know if it... I might have caught her inner thigh when it bounced up or something. Showing some pain, wincing a little bit. Oh, high and inside. So Harrison, 3 1. Piece of that. Oh, wow. Uh, unlucky there off of Harrison's tip of her glove. Can't get to it. Volley goes after it, pulls back. So they're going to go on an E1 on that one. Drake on the lefty. Zilla is your batter. Swings. One ball, two strikes on Zilla, who struck out looking for last appearance at bat. Gets out, goes down looking again. So Harrison's got Zilla's number today. That'll be the first out of the inning. Runner on first. And that's going to be a base hit out left field. Puts the runner on first and second. So bats coming alive. Courtesy comes in for the catcher. Number 18, Harris, is your batter. Harris walked on her last appearance. Swings and fouls a one hopper back to Wishmeyer. Gets her on the inside edge. Harrison gets ahead here with two strikes on. Harrison hop one hops it in and it's gonna be in the dirt and it's gonna advance the runners to so the force out taken away. Mm -hmm. 
So runners on second and third as a result. Nice routine ground ball, the quick. And that's going to get a run. So good job by Click to get it in. Nice try by Wishmeyer, but the runner is safe at home. The out is made, however. And now it's Tomaska. Number five. Center fielder. Ball inside. Here's a nice pitch. Harrison hits. Biggs, we're going to miss on a 54-mile-an-hour fastball. Give it a couple more MPH from Nice stop by Wishmeyer. And that's going to be 31 is your, is your count. Two down here. 5-4. That's going to be a walk. Put your runner on. Causes a force-out situation, though, at least. So Taka looking to get out of this one. They got runners on the corners. Two down. Lead by one. 5-4 against the Southwest uh, Minneapolis Southwest Lakers. Wishmeyer calls together the infield, have talk it through. Harrison now faces Stock, who she walked her last appearance. So Different difference. So one ball on stocks and now runners on second and third. No force out any longer. Swing and a miss. One ball, one strike on stock. Swing and a miss. One ball, two strikes. Ball high. 22 now is your count. Lizzie Harrison pitching for the Skippers, the junior. There she got her. Nice job there by Harrison to get out of that mess. But the damage again was done as one run. Let's see. I Only one hit I got in there, one error. Scores the one run. And two left on. So now Tonka's got to go back, bring out the bats, get them going. Hang a couple points, runs rather. It's time. 
Wishmeyer comes in. She's going to lead us off. And so we're at the 5 6 7 position. Wishmeyer, her last appearance, popped out deep to uh, right field. Oh, for 2 on the day. My spray chart's not working very well for on her first at bat. My apologies. So, Wishmeyer, Harrison, Kulberg are your batters. And Wishmeyer steps in. Wishmeyer takes first pitch ball. Wishmeyer likes that one. Gets after just a little early on the slow pitch. That's what. Uh, this pitcher is coming in high 40s only. And uh, I think it's throwing off Minnetonka. One on one's your count on Wishmeyer. Likes that one, takes it out deep. And that's going to drop and get a single for Wishmeyer. So Wishmeyer starts us off with a single. Harris steps in. Harrison, rather. Harrison, who's one for two on the day. Takes one up. Oh, right into the glove of the catch. Pitch. And it's thrown out. So good reaction time by Pitch. Puts Wishmeyer on second, though, or a uh, courtesy runner, I should say. Goldberg steps in. She's known for her bat. Likes that one. Oh, no. And that's not going to help her get to first. So two outs now. Callen steps in. Callen walked through both appearances. That one change up comes in. We're swinging a, swing a miss. I don't know what the change up came in, and it probably had to come in at the mid 30s. 41 on that one. Takes that one, pops it up deep. Ooh, and miss by the outfielder. And that's gonna put Wishmeyer, or uh, runners at first and second, or second. And the runner comes in, Campion was running for Wishmeyer, so she comes all the way from second. She's known for her wheels. Callen gets on, gets double. And Donaldson's going to step in for the Skippers. So Skippers put up another one, 6-4. And there, Donaldson, big hit. 
Big hit to the fence. And that's going to be a double. Stand up double. Scores one more. Callen comes in. Nice RBI for Donaldson. And back to the top of the lineup where Volling will step in. Volling looking to stay hot. Got our three for three on the day. This is the top of our lineup. Ball. Delivery comes in. Balling doesn't like. Holds. Three balls, no strikes. This is a batter's count. I watched it. I don't love that when people watch a 3 0 count. Personally, I think you should swing for the fences if you got that chance. There's an argument to be had either way on that. There, she did swing for the fences, and now we all. That's what I was saying, is now we have a full count situation. Boy, did she get a piece of that. That thing went up into the stands at the adjacent football and soccer fields. Bounces one in. She takes her base on the balls. So... Donaldson sitting out at scoring position at second. Singer's going to step into the plate, the lefty. Addie Singer. Junior. Slab hitter gets offers, and that's going to be a strike. Singer likes that one. Follows it up out of play. I hope people can get into that. Uh, it's all fenced off, the track and everything. Hopefully people can get in there. There's quite a few foul balls in there. So Singer down now, 0-2. Oh, surprised yourself on that one. And it dropped. So I think Singer was even surprised she got contact on that, which resulted in a perfectly placed ball right in front of the outfielder. She had to work quite a bit to get there. And Donaldson rounds and comes in and scores. Ball to Hedrick. Hedrick likes that one, gets ahead of it though. It's a tip strike. Ball high. 21's your count. Timeout called by the catch. Gonna go chat with your pitcher, bring in her infield. Edric and Click will have a chat. So we're two down here. Skippers have put three up in this half inning. So I got a score of eight in favor of the Skippers, I think, to four. Beautiful spring evening here. Playing. Starting to see a couple buds coming out on the trees. Umpire calls them back out. Hedrick got 
two runners out there on first and second. Hedrick likes that one. Oh, that could be catchable. A nice dive. Can't get to a good effort by first base. Hedrick. Two and two, ball high. Fills up the count. Three balls, two strikes on Hedrick. Ball rolls in, Hedrick's gonna walk. And that's gonna, once again, give Click another opportunity with bases loaded. So not that often you're gonna see it at least once in a game, but let alone twice. Let's see what Click's got in her here. Last time she put one at the fence on the track. She likes that one, that one she takes way out. And that's going to be caught again by the same spot. <laughs> Bases loaded twice in the same spot. So good job. Good play. F8 that time. Wow. Click thought she had a grand slam there, but no such luck. But great job by the defender. The outfielder, rather, for out number three. So one, two, three, four, five hits result in the three runs. I don't see any else. Two is coming in for 16, so Grace Prowley is going to be coming out to throw the round ball. Haven't seen her yet this season. Of course, it's only the second game, so when you got three pitchers, it's going to be hard to get all three of them out there, but especially when they're performing. So Prowley, Grace Prowley, senior, known for her movement on the ball. Does it bug you if I sit here? You sure? Weesh. And as business as usual for Prolly, who Not known for her top end, but she certainly does a fantastic job. 16 for four, thank you. So Prawley comes in. First pitch strike, so good start of the season for Prawley. Diamarco. Probably gets you going again. So the off-speed pitches is what probably is just money with. At the drop, third strike. Click gets it. Wishmeyer picks it up quickly. Nice job. And the off-speed pitches even throwing Wishmeyer for a loop as well. They're kind of Fun to watch. First pitch ball to Walker, the lefty. <laughs> Gets her going on the outside, reaching. Wow, this is fun to watch. Probably gets her again on the outside edge. Yeah. 
Ball two strikes, gets her swinging again. Another drop, third strike, but Wishmeyer doesn't have to get off her knees to deliver, makes it, so Click will get it out, make the catch, and that brings us down to number two, which is, I think, yep, number two comes in, Smith. Smith, who I got us an out. I don't have a spray chart for her on that one, but she's probably 0 for 1 on the day. That's a foul ball. to tell you from my perspective which is straight behind the umpire that was on the inside edge but uh, I don't get paid the big bucks so I'll stay right here dribbler over to short throw is made click gets her makes the squeeze gets her out at first for the typical 6-3 three. three up three down so Grace Prowley comes out strikes out two Gives up no hits at all. So just like that, the Lakers are back on the, on the turf. It's not really turf, it's grass. So we're going to be at, it looks like, 5, 6, 7 in the lineup. How can that be? Yeah, because Click uh, got... Out on the pop fly. They left three stranded twice for clicks. She's left three out there. So Wishmeyer will lead us off. Wishmeyer, who had a nice hit out to right field, her last at bat. So she's one for three on the day. And here comes Coach MB Wig, walks in your camera right there. Hello, Coach. Ball high on the warm up. So, is this a new? Yep, 16 is in for two. So, two is pitching. Now we got 16. We get some numbers on her. Speed. Forty-seven. So not a lot of speed out of these Laker pitchers that I've seen so far today. Change up there, 43. So Wishmeyer let us off with a nice hit at her last appearance at bat. Let's see what she's got, another one in her. On deck is Harrison, then Kulberg. Five, six, seven batters in the lineup. One hops one in at around 40. Ball one. Ellie Collins warming up in the batty with the uh, bow net behind us. Swing and a miss, 47. She actually tipped it. One ball, one strike. Ball high. Twenty-one is your count. Ball outside, forty-four. Three balls, one strike on Wishmeyer.
Comes in low. 48, though, so she brought up the speed a bit. That's her fastball. Missed it, though, so Wishmeyer's going to get on as a result of the balls. So number one. So Campion's going to run for Wishmeyer. Wishmeyer, the catcher. And here we go, back at the action. Lizzie Harrison steps in the box. Ball one. Like that one, swing and a miss. Lizzie Harrison, one and one. She's one for three today. She got a double she came out with her last first. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, her first at bat, she hit a nice double. Get into the shortstop, into an out, and back at the pitcher, her last at bat. Ball low. Show down to first. Thirty one to count on Harrison. This is definitely a batter's count. Ball high, and that's going to put her on with another walk. Second walk for this pitcher. Number three for Minnetonka, Lily Kennedy, the sophomore. She's going to be running now for Harrison, the pitcher. Kullberg is up all high. Goldberg, who's big strike, 44 on the pitch speed. One ball, one strike. Goldberg, who's two for three on the day. Holds, oh, good hold, 47. 21. Oops, sorry. Dang. That one's going to go left field. Cheapers. I'm not sure what the odds are that I would fat finger the camera and miss that for Kahlberg. Sorry about that, fans. Kahlberg's going to get a base hit. So three for four on the day. And she gets the ribby. She got two ribbies. Wild pit or pass ball. I'm going to give that to her. So Culberg will go second on the pass ball. I don't think it was a wild pitch. Gallon is your batter. One ball, no strikes. Watches that one bring through. One and one, your count on Callen. Bree Callen. He's walked at her two first appearances. Follows it up out of play. Got a double on her last at bat, and now she's faced with a one and two count. Here in the top of the fifth inning.
Whoa! At third base. Hit hard at third base. Got her glove on it to knock it down. And all runners are going to, well. So Kulberg remains on second. So Flex is coming in for DP. DP is Donaldson. That means Harrison, I mean Collins is going to come in. So Ellie Collins has been playing DP, or uh, Flex rather. So Collins comes in now. It's a good situation to be in for Nataka. Ball low. Ball high, so two balls, no strikes. Two balls, no strikes on Collins, the captain, well, the co captain of this squad, her and Ava Click. Your captains. 30 is your count, 3 0. If runners on first and second, just to load them up right here. She watches that. And I tell you, I just don't understand it. Thirty-one to count. Ball inside. That's gonna. And that's why you do it, right? Right there is that you wanna put a runner on. But I tell you. You got a pitcher who's throwing high 40s at a fastball. You got a senior stepping in who can just crush it. I just, I got to tell you, I'd like to see a couple more runs batted in. That's just me. That takes us to the top of the lineup. Balling. First pitch ball high and outside. Excuse me. Ball two. So balling with the bases loaded situation. She came out with a big hit at the first inning. And we got a situation here. Nice play. Nice try. Great job by the catch. Well throwed ball, throwing ball to the pitcher at the plate. Now that was a great defensive play. It didn't return into results for him. Actually the Minnetonka skippers will put another one up on the board and runners will advance taking away the force out but oftentimes I see on those wild pitches where the catcher just throws it or the pit catcher throws it up in the air to the pitch and that does absolutely no good because they're going to be coming in low. So great job. Defensive effort but uh Tonka able to capitalize, so ball four puts volleying on, and that's going to call a timeout. Catch wants to bring in the infield. we got bases loaded for Singer here, the lefty. She's going to come out. Hedrick on deck. Beautiful spring afternoon here at Pershing Field Park. No bleachers here for softball. Two fields back to back. We're looking out over into one. There's a church in the background. And a gas station. Lovely, lovely part of the world. Singer looking to get a couple RBIs. First pitch, ball. Ball. 
Ball inside, throws down at third. Two balls, no strikes on Singer. Ball inside. So 30 is your count. Another ball will walk one in. Ooh, no outs here in this half inning. All four outside. Missed. And that scores one then. Since bases were loaded. So that's four this half inning for the skippers. Hedrick. Ball inside and high. Holds in a ball. Two balls, no strikes on Hedrick. Ball low. So nine can nine straight ball ten no wait. Twelve straight balls thrown. And that's tough. That runs brings in another run. And Click is up now, so we'll see if we can get some pitches across for her. This is Click's third time that she's been faced with bases loaded. Ball low. I know she wants it. She both times she's had bases loaded, she's put it at the warning track and robbed by the center fielder or left fielder, right fielder. Ball high. So looking for just anything across the plate. Click will take it. Click doesn't take that one though. Oh, that was a pitch. That was a pitch. Easy for me to say. Ball three. Three balls, one strike. Quick tail holds. She's going to walk. In another run. I'm going to keep her in there. This pitcher who's struggling, she's walked in four. Giving up six runs this inning. Ball inside. On Wishmeyer's the batter. Ball high. This one getting away from the Lakers. Likes that one, then cranks it up. Out to left field, scores one, scores two. And Click's going to hold that second. So great job by Wishmeyer to keep her bat alive. And so Click is now at second. So that was Wishmeyer's second time up this inning. So we've gone through the order once. Harrison now up to bat. <laughs> oh, and Harrison gets beaned. Ouch.
So base is loaded. Click on third. Hedrick on second. Wishmeyer on second, brother. I'm sorry. Hedrick on first. Kahlberg is your batter. Out of play. Calvert takes from way left. Go, go. Oh, it's foul, but it was over. Kahlberg, who was looking to get two games, two home runs. Wow. <laughs> Kylie Kahlberg, big bat. That would have been a... Grand slam, she holds. Two balls, two strikes on Kahlberg. Kahlberg takes one, follows it up, hopefully, yep, and it gets out of play. So some of the best pitches by this pitcher now have been coming out of her in this last uh, last two batters. Or Culberg. Oops, sorry about that, folks. Two balls, two strikes. That's not gonna bring us to a full count. Colbert, full count. Likes that one, takes, smokes it way out to the left, to the wall, bounces. That's going to score one. And they're going to hold from the, oh! Campion almost takes a digger at home, coming across. So Colbert stays hot on the season. Gets a double. Couple RBIs or one RBI. So Campion, who is running for Wishmeyer, comes in. So Wishmeyer alone, her position has come in, come across the bay home plate three times this game. Reed Callen takes a strike. One ball, one strike. The runners on second and third. So ball two, two balls, one strike. We got no outs yet this inning. And we're still in the top of five. That's going to be fair. That's going to score one, two, I mean. Culver come across. Wow, nice shot there by Callen down the first third line. Hits third base. Stays foul. So she's going to get a... Double. So I'm not sure if there's a 10 run rule or what, but one, two. They got four, so one.
Collins takes first pitch strike. Likes that one, dribbles to second or third, scooped up by short. Can't make the throw, so off the tip of the glove by third, but dibbles, dibbles, uh, deflects over to the shortstop glove, but she can't make the play. So runner holds at second. Collins gets on. Probably going on an E5 on that one. Sorry, Ellie. First pitch strike to volume top of lineup for Minnetonka. Ball high and outside. One and one. Fouls it. One ball, two strikes on the leadoff, who's got a single, a single. Single again, and then they get to walk the last two appearances. Ball high and outside, so 22. Nice changeup, drifted in. Singer on deck. Time called as another ball comes in off the... I don't know where it came from. 22 to count. Falling. Knocked down by the short. Can't make the throw. So she knocks it down. So another... Going to go with an E6 on that one. I'm sorry. Falling. Puts Callen over on third. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen times I have coming across home plate. Eighteen to four, so no. Ten. I don't know if there's a run rule after so many innings or how it goes, but. This one's getting a little out of hand. There's no outs. Addie Singer steps in. Ball outside. Likes that one. Singer, that one. Nice play by... Great job by the... Shortstop. Heads up play. So Kalen's going to get out on a 1 2 for the first out of the inning. Hedrick is your batter. The strike. Ooh, save. Nice throw down by the catch. One and one on Hedrick. One down here. Base is loaded. Two balls, one strike. Hop fly. That's in play. Hard to get to, though. So foul ball. Hedrick stays alive. Two balls, two strikes. Come on. 
ball, gets a one hops. Good job by a catch. So now Hedrick works into a full count. Hedrick takes a hack at that, follows it out of play. Stays alive, 32 is your count. Ball high, so Hedrick is going to get on. Another runoff come across, base is loaded. So this is interesting. You don't see this every day. Ava Click now. Will bat with bases loaded. For the fourth time. Sorry about that. Just getting my book all dialed in. Fourth time she's facing a situation where she's got bases loaded. Let's see if she can convert on this one. Take strike. Ball high and outside. Nice glove by the catch. 21's a count. Ball high. 31's your count. All right, click. Click wants to get a piece of this one. Give her a pitch. And ball outside, no chance. So Click will walk. And then I'll put another one across. So that puts Singer on third, Hedrick on second, Click on first, and Wishmeyer going to bat, I think, for the third time this inning. First pitch strike. Wishmeyer likes that one. That one drops. She's going to round second. We'll hold it second. Now we got something at home here. And Click's going to be out. So, not sure why Click was out. I was. So Wishmeyer gets a double. Scores Singer, scores Hedrick, Hedrick. And then Click is out. Nice crack of the bat there. Wow, what a catch! What a catch. Diving catch. Big catch by the outfielder. One fifty. We'll write down on the clock. That's a good time to watch for our highlights. Da 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 da. Sports Center goes off. I'm gonna see. Uh, one three. There we go. Two is coming in for 16. Flex to stay in the game. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Scored. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. So far is what I have for a score. So what a way to get out of that inning. 
think everybody was a little bit relieved if uh, skippers let these Lakers back in here. We're going to be here all night long. So I got four, four, so four to 21, I think is what our score is right now. All right, so from my, what I can tell, I think we're back at one, two, three in the batting order. Nice strike there. Harrison is your batter. Prawley is your pitcher. Bounces one in, hops into the glove of Wishmeyer. One ball, one strike. Swing and a miss. 40 it said on the pitch. Speed. It's ho! Oh, that's an atom ball. Right at him. Volling. Ready for that. That's at third base. Danger zone that just comes cracking off so fast. And I tell you, I'd be wearing a face mask if I was them. But, oh, no. They didn't pay for the dental the orthodontics. Ball outside, 44 on the pitch speed. Zilla, the lefty, is up. And she's going to get on. Tough ball there, but good job. Her, she hit it, just one hopped in front of Wishmeyer, just trickled away from her. So base hit will be awarded to Zilla. She'll go one for three on the day. Smith, your batter, change up, drops in at 39 miles an hour. Probably brings it inside 44. Nice throw down to click as uh, the runner advanced off the Mishandled ball. Two balls, no strikes. Swing and a miss. Two balls, one strike on the number three batter in the lineup. Also up this inning. No outs here. No, I'm sorry. One out from the great catch by Volling. Ball inside, misses. Three balls, one strike on the batter. Three balls, one strike. Misses inside, 41. So, good pitch, just a good miss. Now, look at this. Now, the Lakers got something going. They got runners on first and second, one down here. Bottom of five. This pitch, 44. Foul ball. That'll be a dead ball. Two strikes on the batter. No balls, two strikes on Harris. Drops one in just outside. One ball, two strikes. Get you at the handle. 
Oh, the throw is off, or I'm not sure. One's going to score. Not sure. Yeah, the throw is off, it sounds like. I was looking down at the phone. So runner will get on as a result of an E. And the error. So that's going to score another one for the Lakers. Swing and foul. Tamaska, your batter. No balls, two strikes. One down here. Top of five or bottom of five. 21 to four in favor of the Minnetonka Skippers here at Southwest or at Pershing Park. Drops it just misses high. One ball, two strikes. Probably is pitching for Minnetonka. Oh, off a click, clicks glove. That's going to score two. So two are going to score now. I guess. Uh, Probably have to go with an E3. We'll have to see how that scored on click. It was a hard ground ball at the base, but I guess uh, you're going to say she was fieldable, so I think that would be an E3. So two errors result in so far three runs. This inning swing and a miss by 27. Stock. She's 0 for 2 on the day. 0 for 1. She did walk her last first appearance and walked struck out before that probably gets another strike on it the wishmeyer throws down makes play at first runner gets back Well hit, fielded, got her. Safe, they called it, huh? Interesting. So, bobbled. By short. Tries to get the backhand. Ellie Collins. So I think. So runners on first and second. DiMarco. DiMarco is up. There's a strike. 44 on the pitch speed. One ball, two strikes is the count. Probably trying to get out of this mess of an inning, half inning for. Nice job by Wishmeyer to scoop it up. Twenty-two is your count. Brings it inside just high. Goes for ball two. 22 is your count. There's a big pitch. 43 and a swing and a miss for a strikeout. That's two down. And we are at batter number eight. Eight in the lineup. Walker is the pitcher. She sports the number four. Oh no, 16 is in for four. Ball one. Nice change up gets her. Swinging. 
One ball, one strike. Ball low. 21's your count here. Swing and a miss. That's two and two. The Lakers. Ball. So full count against number 16. Foul. So the Lakers have managed to rack up seven runs here on our skippers. It's a hit there. Nice bro knocked down by Singer, and that's the ball game. What a game. So we're going to finish it on the 4-3. We're out number three. The game is over. And whoops, you probably don't need to see the feet of the players. Let us see this. So I don't have the recap from Game Changer here in front of me, so I'm just going to give you my recap from what I can see. I didn't uh, tally up all the hits and whatnot, but Minnetonka, the bats come alive, cycle through in the fifth inning. We get through our lineup almost three times if we didn't, racking up a, a myriad of runs. And so we're going to take the victory. I think we're probably 21 to 8 is what it probably comes out unofficially. Check the... Uh, the funny papers tomorrow on that. Bases loaded, faced by a lot of the batters for Minnetonka. Not able to seize. Click drops two at the warning track. Almost gets two grand slams. Kulberg does almost the same. She actually gets on. But Minnetonka comes out. Some defensive effort, uh, some defensive flops. We're going to have to work on that. That's not going to win titles. So hopefully we got those out of our out of the bag now, out of our system, and we'll go forward and play some clean softball. So with that, Minnetonka Skippers win big here at Pershing Field Park in South Minneapolis in the neighbor Fulton neighborhood. So with that, I'm John Click signing off on behalf of your Minnetonka Skippers. Go Skippers!